Hello, my souls. Wrong button. Hello, my souls, and welcome back to... Oh, oh, outward. We'll set onward. This isn't onward, this is outward. And yes, I'm wearing the same fucking shirt. Oh well, I've been wearing the same shirt for three days. So sue me. I usually don't wear clothing, so... Hello, Johnson. Hello, Delint. Hello, guys. It's me, also known as uh, Heather. Hello, Robert. Hello, Delint. Hello, Aiden. Hello, Nix. Om nom nom. <sighs> <sighs> so, by the way, what do you guys think about... And I, I know I've asked this before... But what do you guys think about us starting these streams off like this with the more personal kind of hi, let's let's chat for a little while before the game starts kind of thing. Better? Worse? Indifferent? Do you like it? Do you not like it? I want to know what you guys think. I think I like it too, uh, Heather. Delint apparently he apparently thinks it's a good idea. Robert likes it. Well, I'm glad you guys like it because it's kind of here to stay. Because it it gives me a chance to open up and actually talk to people. <laughs> Aiden says he's okay with it. Why do I have a dragon running circles around me? I mean, it's adorable, but why do I have a dra uh, dragon running circles around me? That's a good reason. What kind of shoes did you get? Sneakers, high tops, cut tops, what? Rocks? <laughs> Personally, I like high tops. I know they're kind of the stereotypical skater shoe, but I like high tops. <sighs> Outdoor sandals, yay. Sandals definitely need extra breaking in. Now I've got a weird question for you. With or without uh, socks? I find I like sandals mostly without socks, uh, but at the same time, if they have those straps that rub up against the back of my fucking, like, foot, like the heel, uh, I can't, I can't wear them without socks. Not unless they're able to be fitted, and a lot of the cheap brands, they're not able to be fitted. You're introducing Yuki to the Carnix. Oh well. Let's get into this, shall we? Oh. Woo. And I'm going to be doing some exploring and all that today. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna keep carrying maybe two firestones in my pocket. I'm down to fucking. I'm, I'm gonna carry three of those in my pocket. And yeah, three reloads. I don't need extra of those. They're not really worth the sell, but I don't need extra of them. I don't really mind bagpipes myself. They're 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 a fun instrument, but at the same time, it's one that annoys the crap out of people. I, I kinda don't mind that aspect of it either. Oh ooh. Well yay. Alright, I will point out it is closer to night right now than day. So it's gonna be one of those I'm gonna like sell some stuff and then sleep really quick. Greetings, friend. I'm sitting here selling the meat mostly. I can survive off of eggs. I am gonna have to do that though. Cause hello, Stone Ferret. Uh, cause one of the things I've been considering trying to do is figure out like how to get a lot of mana regenerating stuff. And I've come to the conclusion that I need to get the mana regenerating waters. Like I need to stock up on them. Because those alone are good for mana regeneration. Like, they're remarkably good for mana generation. Ooh, excuse me. Hmm. And since we got the trog area done, I'm gonna need to find a new place to explore, so... Uh... Come morning in game, what I'm gonna do... I'm going to sleep for... I'll give it two hours tonight. Huh. Do I have anything to cook? No, I, d I don't. I'm trying to figure out how to spend some time. I guess I could go get some salt water and cook that down. I don't really need much salt right now, though. 
I should turn those into a mushroom bar, though. I can sell the larval eggs. Hey, Ramon. Okay, so I've got tired, which stamina regen, mana regen. Oh, wait. Being exhausted regenerates my mana. That's twisted. Is there something you need? I don't need that. Those are going to go bad. But what I can buy is a couple of these. Okay, so this will get me a lot of uh, salt water here. Oh, hi. I can fish some more? Okay, that's four things of salt water there. That's twisted. Uh, stone ferret? Yeah, I'm gonna be getting stoned and going to watch a movie with my brother. So, I mean, celebrating 420 the way 420 is meant to be celebrated, yeah. Greetings, friend. Alright, so being tired regenerates my mana just straight up. But it lowers my stamina regeneration by a large margin. I'm assuming if my tired reaches fucking 0%, I just pass out. Like, if my sleep meter reaches 0%, I just probably just pass out. So it's, I, I guess it's a balancing act. Well, first things first.
Hold on. This is going to be something I don't... So, hey, Yuki. That was actually kind of the plan for Saturday. Was I was going to figure out when you were available. Because me and my brother are going to be going for the movie early, relatively early. Uh, so, I mean, if, if it's your day off, just coordinate with me, man. I know we've been supposed to do your chill stream uh, for a while now, and I did tell you it was going to be effectively your birthday gift, uh, you know, from me. And we haven't been able to, mostly because I've, I've been crazy busy, emphasis on crazy. Hmm. Okay. Onward, food waste item. Okay, that's the purpose of it. So apparently the food waste item actually has a purpose. Okay, I should probably... Since the salt has a weight, and that's a pound and a half of salt. Jesus fuck. Jesus fuck waffles. I don't know, Nix. I think you're asking the wrong question. I don't know. I mean, would you consider that a reason to be there for them to be good? Do you like salty waffles? Nom nom. I'm doing better each day, weirdly enough. Well, actually, no, not weirdly enough. Because ever since... Effectively, uh... Well, ever since my last break... 
I've been doing what I can to effectively, uh, you know, not let my crazy get to me too much. I'm gonna go make some tea. There's one. There's two. My three morning cups of tea. As a mage, I must drink three cups every morning of seaweed tea. By the way, <clears throat> theoretically, how fast would somebody have to slap a steak to cook it? I, I don't fucking know. I don't know and I don't care. If you're slapping a steak to cook it, then dude, if you're putting that much energy into cooking something, use that energy for something else. Become a hooker. Let's <laughs> guarantee you. If you're using that kind of energy to need? slap your steak to cook it, you you could get paid so much more. Use the same hand motion, just different hand set, uh, just different hand shape, and I guarantee you, you could do it, do it with both too. You can get paid a lot of money for this. There probably is, but I just, eh. <clears throat> okay. So I'm going to do a little bit of a roundabout way to check and see. First things first, I need to check and see if there's oil. Second thing I need to check is, uh, I, I need some turnips. But my main thing today is I'm going to be going to the uh, area with all the mono water or whatever the fuck we're going to call it today. Also, I'm, I'm thinking of removing my axe for now because it's really just dead weight. So I want to see how many days it takes, by the way, for that for that oil to regenerate. It's one of the reasons I've been checking it so often. Oh, hi, Yin. <laughs> Bye, Yin. Goodbye, Mr. Yeenal Beanal. <sighs> Leave it to somebody on the internet to, uh, to, you know, sit there slapping their cock. I'll eat an egg. Eggs regenerate my health. They regenerate my ha health a little bit like the uh, turnips regenerate my mana. 
It's one of the reasons I like carrying eggs. Is it steaming? It's steaming! So it's every what? About four days? Three days? Yeah. Why are you guys throwing food at each other? No, I'm saying eggs are excellent. You guys are probably wondering what the hell I'm doing. So, something dawned on me. This game essentially explains it to you. Mages have to be more clever. Because they are physically more... Uh... So mages have to be more clever. Yeah. Well then. Let's set that there. Let's see how clever this little mage can be. Where, where are you? Hold on. Did it disappear? Feels like it straight up disappeared.
No, it just went further up. Okay. Come on down here, lady. Come on over here, lady. Come on, lady. You can do this. Come on, lady. You're smart enough to get it right. Come on, lady. Hello again, you kid. Num num.
Bye, bitch. So this is how a mage should fight. I did not see the nuggies, sadly. I do. I will. I will kind of, you know, search back. Uh, as for chill stream tomorrow, that's kind of the plan. I mean, you just gotta let me know. Uh... <laughs> nuggies on warfare. It's that's cute. Okay, move to bag, bag, move to bag, move to bag, move to bag, move to bag, bag. Okay, now the main purpose of taking that guy out was so I can freely come in here with no... Uh, fear. And come pick up some more seaweed and fish. Uh, it'd have to be a little later because me and my brother were planning to go to the movies and our movie starts around, uh, like 120. So we're going to probably be going to the 121. Uh, unless we decide to go to the later one, which, if that's the case, we'll wind up doing the stream. I'd, I'd have to coordinate with my brother, because we do have plans for that day. Upside, though, is we'll be able to fit pretty much everything in. And again, I'm sorry it took so long to get around to your birthday chill stream, uh, Yuki. I really am. It, it's just been crazy busy as I said and again emphasis on crazy ow I am losing snuggle juice By the way, I don't even know where the fuck I came up with the uh, concept of snuggle juice. It's just, it's a thing. I don't know why I started calling blood snuggle juice. But you gotta admit, it's a catchy way. It's a catchy thing to call it. Did I reload my bowl? No, I did not. But, you know, one of the things I've noticed throughout these last couple of months, throughout all the shit that's happened between me and a bunch of my friends, or so-called friends, and everything, uh, with everything that's gone on, I kind of want to be unapologetically myself. I want to stop trying to be what everyone wants me to be, and just be me. Because when it comes right down to it, that's all I really can be. So I'm done bending over backwards, I think, to try to entertain other people in what they want to do. And I'm just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say if people want to stream with me, ask to stream with me. But at the same time, if you want me to stream with you and you want me to bend over backwards to come to what you do, There's got to be some give and take there. 
I'm willing to give, you can't just be willing to take. And no, that's not so much to you, Yuki, that's in general. Because I do want to start up the collab streams again, I really do. But I don't want them to be this rigorous scheduled thing anymore. Of, hey, we have to do this at this time! I want them to be, if people want to be a part of my life, if they want to be a part of what I'm doing, they can just opt to join. That's kind of what I've, that's kind of what I've been doing recently. See, that's the other thing, too, is I'm not going to expect people to, you know, hop on the same system just to work with me. But at the same time, understand, I'm, I'm not going to, like, best example I can give is I'm poor as fuck. If I have to build a brand new PC and deck it out with the best of the best of the best just to be able to come and hang out with you, we're not hanging out, sorry. By the same merit, if you feel like you have to come and hang out with me by, you know, fucking getting an Xbox Golden. Veer, if you wanted to come join the stream, all I'd expect you to have is a willingness to download the fucking Xbox app on a phone or onto your computer or what have you. And to have, like, a headset so you're not sounding like you're, you know... Uh, recording off of somebody's butthole. <laughs> that, that's legit all I expect. Cool. If you want to come hang out, let me know. Ask. I am also going to limit it to a certain number of people, like, per stream. Um, eh. I mean, Veer, you might need to update it. That's a problem I usually run into when it starts getting fucky. No, you, you don't need gold. Well, you need gold to join a game. You don't need gold to join a party anymore. Oh, and by the way, it's no longer uh, Xbox Gold or what have you. It's uh, Xbox Membership, Xbox Core Membership, or Xbox... Uh, what's it called? Like, their premium thing. Don't worry, I see what you've done to those bodies, you horrible, horrible people. We'll deal with you later. Ow. But yeah, no, the whole point of what I was saying, though, is I, I don't really ever expect the world from other people. So I'm, I've, I'm going to stop allowing people to expect the world of me. Because at the end of the day, I am just one person. If I'm expected to, like, 
hold the weight of the world on my shoulders just because, oh, people look up to me. Nah. That's not how that works. Never been how that works, but that's that's not how that works. Okay. Kind of, yeah. But I mean, I'm tired of people assuming that, like, that I will be there when I'm not okay, or that I will be perfect when I'm obviously struggling. Part of the reason I started this channel was to help people understand that, you know, not everyone is perfect. Hell, I'm about as far from it as you can get. But it also helps people to understand that even people like me, we're still people. We still have the same needs, we still have... The fuck is Alpha Jerky? <laughs> Exactly. But it, when I originally made this channel, I knew I was fucked up. I knew I'd probably always be this kind of fucked up. I've known for a very long time that I'm not mentally okay. One of the reasons why I decided to make a channel and to be open with people and to be, you know, available for people to see and interact with is because... I know I'm messed up, I know I'm crazy in a lot of ways. But it helps people to see from a distance that even people like me are human. And sometimes all we need is for somebody to listen. But yeah, we're all a bit mad here. Oh god, yeah, that'll explode. Not a good idea. Also, it'll taste like ass because far too sweet. I just don't feel like guys that want to leave me alone. Also, now the question becomes... Is the doorway... Or is the way in here still open? Can I just sprint through? What you need? Listen up. Oh, 
Well, we're about to find out. I can just run it. Yeah, I mean, definitely. E. All right. Later, Veer. Num num. But yeah, no. One of the huge reasons I made this channel was to let people know, like, just let people see a more human side of people like me. Because at the end of the day, it's we are all human. We all deserve to be treated with some semblance of respect. We all deserve to be you know, able to believe that we're not just a burden to the world around us, you know? All right. Now I've got a theory and a weird thought. Is that how you get sugar? Is that how you get sugar? So wait. That's a thought. What if I add a lot of sugar back to it? Okay, so that just creates a lot of food waste. Welcome. I am a watcher of the ley line. Magic is the weapon of a patient warrior. Okay, so that gets me ter the termit pottage thing. 
Perfect. Perfect. I could effectively live here if I wanted to. Can I train with you? Welcome, may never. If you wish to learn the most nope. complex of more. spells, seek out rune magic. Feel free to use one of our boats to return to the surface. Okay, so... All right. So now that I've got my... Hey, Aiden, here's a thought with a spiderweb screen. Uh, why not? You know. This is where running is an option. I mean, no, CRT monitors were badass. They also worked quite well. It's just they had the annoying ringing. What are you talking about, Nix? Oh, Jesus, Fuckleberry.
is that? That's not a tone. So what is that? Strange workbench here. If you know how to use it, perhaps you can craft something special here. Okay, good to know. That's something to learn about. There's my town. Okay. That gets me down onto the sand. If I just steer clear of those, I won't really have any enemies. Also, you gotta admit, this is this game has some beautiful imagery. Just Aiden, as I was saying, when it comes to having a phone that, like, is at risk of cutting you, why not just get a uh, screen protector, overlay it over the broken screen? I know it's a very, very shitty fix, but at very least it would make it to where you don't, you're not risking cutting up your fingers. shit. Burn to death. That's what I mean by mages have to be more tactical. I'm learning how to be... And to think differently. I 
I don't mind traveling at night in this game, even if it is dark as all fuck. And understand, it is dark as all fuck. The glare from my screen, and I actually think I can change the... Yeah, brightness all the way up feels like a cheat. But I mean, right about there? Can you guys see a little better now? Because for me, this still feels dark enough. At very least with the glare on the screen. Because it's still hard for me to see. But a little better for you guys. Because, I mean, in dark areas, like on the screen, I can see my outline. Actually, hold on. I'm going to go and see what one more... Okay, so that that's, that's what we were originally at. Now you can actually see some, like, some kind of definition... And it's not, it doesn't feel overly cheaty to me. Is there something you need? You know, I don't, I don't feel like I'm ever going to run out. Okay. Hey yes, there. the light does very much attract enemies. Alright. Yes, they can see when you turn the light on and off. I've actually used it already a couple times to lure enemies. If, you, if you'd been watching, you'd have seen that. Oh, god damn it. And as you can see, in some cases, I can't see unless I have my light on. Even with the lighting this way. Like, this I can see in, because a little bit of light. But not an excessive amount, you know? Keep three of those on me. I'll be right back, everybody. I've actually got a pee. So give me a moment.
Here's hoping, Aiden. If it does freak out, just switch it back. There we go. There we go. So now I've got fire stones, stealth potions, both things I can make. Hey, that's how to make astral potion. Good to know. Incendiary charges aren't that bad. Okay. All right, I'm going to store the water in there. Sleep for an hour. Put three into uh, repairing my spear. Oh, no, I'm the Johnson. Later, man. I'll see you later tonight, hopefully. Okay. So. Where should we go today? So there are ancient ruins that I can go and look through, and then there's, uh, what are they called? The, uh, Cabal of the Wind Tower.
All right. So where should I go? Ancient ruins? Or... Should I head towards the, uh... Cabal of the Wind? Oh, I should probably go put those travel rations away. Because <coughs> they do take up a lot of space. Ooh. <laughs> oh, ooh. Is there anybody still watching out there? I've been asking y'all a question. Ancient Ruins? Or Cabal of the Wind Tower? Aw, we're in. You guys have your chance to answer right up until I'm done uh, reaching one of the two. What's up, Aiden? <laughs> Awu? Lost a pin. That sucks.
Hmm. I'm pretty sure those are the ancient ruins. Does not open from here. Okay, lady. Okay. I don't know, Aiden. Why won't it open? Why do you think it won't open? Nope, we're not going to be able to Skyrim it. Well, that answers that question. For a second there, I thought that was going to be a way in. It's just straight up dancing over there. Just, lady, I like doing this too much. Let me wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I mean, it's a possibility. I should eat an egg. And drink some sugar water, effectively. Hi, lady. Goodbye, lady. Can I break down arrows? I cannot break down arrows. Damn.
All right. Hey, cool. Okay, so I'm out of fire or uh, fire stones for today. I'm becoming much better at, you know, killing using magic. Okay. Okay, there we go. And oh no, what? Oh, hello, Heather. Okay. I'm going to try going up the mountain, like up that way, because I know there's a lantern up there I can get, but I also know it's going to require me killing multiple enemies. I think I can do it. Like, I'm confident in myself enough that I feel I can do it. And on the way up, I can gather some uh, turnips. Okay. Yes! Two fucking yeans with one cast.
a wool. Okay. Eggs. On a stone and a hack might. Okay. I am going to need to fight a lady over here. Kingdom's Conflux Path. And yes, I'm gonna lean a little bit. You guys won't necessarily be able to see my face. Apologize. Oh, guys. There need not be a fight. Just accept death. Lay down and die. Oh, damn it. Okay, let's do it this way.
Okay, there we go. Okay. I've gotten myself an even more powerful, even more useful lantern. Aiden, is Rufus working or is Rufus not working? Oh, not connecting to the sim. Yeah, that sucks. By the way, another reason I came up here was monostones. More eggies. An okra spice beetle. Okay. Okay, we're getting very, very close to the part that I'm going to have to claim that stupid is as stupid does. Because stupid does this very well. Oh god. Mm. 
That felt good. Come on, lady, can you follow me? While well, you burn alive! That's getting meanly. Get eaten! I rock mantis. Probably stuff the greasy fur. I hope I just put that in the bag. Good. There we go. I'll take the strange rusted sword. Amanda said make this sword fit for a king. Okay. By the way, now we're heading our happy asses down. Back towards home. But first, I'm going to need an hour or two's rest. Eventually, I'll probably be making a uh, camp up here because I know what these butterflies mean. They tell you where it's safe to camp effectively. And each map only has a certain number of them. So I will be setting up camps around uh, the world, so to speak. But I know of one such camp. Sort of. I'm going to get a little bit of rest. 
take the time to, you know, repair some of my equipment. I'll equip this. Because it'll be what I repair tonight. You get a couple hours sleep, a couple hours repairing, stand guard the rest of the time. It's not that bad. Well, no, it's more accurate in this case, a situation of, you're kind of, well, well, here, look. You have to have a bedroll to sleep, out sli uh, sleep outside. I'm going to spend those moments repairing. There we go. You have to balance the time that you're standing guard versus the time that you're sleeping and repairing things. Otherwise, yes, if you have a chance of ambush, you can wake up with a random enemy attacking you. By the way, you'll notice that my fishing harpoon is pretty much repaired. I do need a drink, so... I believe that's the last... Nope, that's not. Okay. Oh, I should go pick up that bedroll. Because if nothing else, uh, else, it's worth, you know, keeping around and buying. Or not buying, but, you know, selling. Oh, Heather, what's up? Being a mage in this game is straight up a balancing of a balancing act of what you can and can't do. Anyways, I've managed to gather another six mana stones, which means I can make a couple fire stones. I've found earned or won effectively a couple cold stones, so those will be helpful later down the line. But mages in this game technically need a horde. Oh, isn't that beautiful? This is the kind of thing I play games like this for.
Hi, dude. Just accept death, please. Okay, I'll have your weapons. I should really remember to, uh... Pick up my backpack before looting. Like, I'm getting remarkably good at fighting people with magic in this game. Hey look, another turmip. Is that just a completely alternate path that I missed? I shouldn't be sprinting. I'm excited. Because I know it's an alternate path. But I shouldn't, you know, be rushing in. Excitement or not. That, that could get me killed. Oh... Hi there, lady. You were just dead and you didn't know it. Okay. So that's the blue collective or blue chamber conflux path. I should probably break some of these down.
I think I'm going to sell the looter armor. But there's a thing to explore here. There's more mana stones over here. More hack might too. That's a no. Okay, so we found a new path. I'll eventually have to go through and clear that conflux path, too. Oh, another mana crystal, I think. Place I can mine more monostone. Ooh, and some more hackmite. So hackmite, I need to point out, is a really, really expensive thing. Like just the fact that I've got fucking three of them—that's 130 or 150 gold. And I believe hackmite is a alchemic. Nope, dark gem with intrinsic or with intricate magic properties. Craftsmen of Levant can create wizardry robes from this material. Okay. So you can have robes made from it. But, I mean, would you guys agree that from where I started playing this a couple days back... Uh, to where I am now. I've gotten far too good with magic. I mean, you guys have seen how I do this. You guys have seen how well I do this. By the way, coming up here to get vantage points, like, that's, that's a camp over there, and those are ruins. I've got some places to explore. I will be starting to head back towards home, though, uh, today, because I do want to go sell some stuff, and I do want to go, like, make some more firestones. And, you know, maybe buy some robes.
Pardon me, lady. Lady, I'm just gonna keep your stuff in my pants. Or more accurately, I'm stuffing my pants with your stuff. Thanks for understanding, lady. That doesn't look like it's where I came from. And I don't think I want to risk going up there right now. Because that is an obvious path. Which means probably like up to a fort or something. And I am ill-equipped for that. <laughs> Although with all the money I've made so far, I can probably afford to buy myself some robes. Yeah, I mean, probably a good idea, Aiden. I was hoping that was going to be a gatherable fucking thing. It looks so pretty to not be gatherable. Oh, by the way, I'm guessing there are spells that are, like, not meant for combat in this game, too. Who's fuzzy? Aiden, are we feeling fuzzy today? There's a safe place to uh, camp there. Okay. By the way, I have gotten a lot of metal, so, I mean, I can make a bunch of those traps now. Oh. So I've been tempted to, like, put out, like, a metric fuck ton of those spike traps out near the bandit. Uh, den. 
and lure a bunch of them into them. And then go around burning the people that survived. And I know, that sounds terrible. Like, just all the way of phrasing that, that sounds evil as hell. But I mean, gotta survive somehow, right? Well, that depends. If I don't know you're there, chances are you're gonna probably see a very pissed off tar. Because jump scaring me in real life, probably not the best idea. Uh, second, I would probably be kicked out of the con. So, probably all around not a good idea to do. If I know you're there, though, I'd, I'd probably just kind of numb on your face. Or, I mean, if I was high, I'd probably grab the pots from you and teach you how to start using them like drums. Well, thank you, Andy. Numb. Uh, by the way, for those who don't know, people who suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder or compound post-traumatic stress disorder, if you scare them, it's, you know how normally somebody's fight or flight response kicks in? Well, nine times out of ten, somebody with PTSD, it's it's not a fight or flight, it's just a fight response. Greetings, friend. Like, straight up, a lot of people with PTSD will just straight out just whap you. sell two of those. I'm gonna use that money to get me some uh, robes. Hey there. Okay. There we are. Hey there. Not bad. That's adorable.
Can I help you? I want to buy something. Mineral tea. Now I know how to make all three of the teas. Greetings, friend! This is awful. Grow up and stop whining, we all have burdens to bear. How do you intend to pay any of your blood price? Oh no, oh no, oh no. Challenge the outside world, you'd be dead in a day. Hmm. Maybe, but I don't care. Either learn and succeed or die, and it's not my problem anymore. Risks don't scare me right hmm. now. Maybe I should beg Ido to teach me some of his personal combat skills first. I don't want to be torn to pieces by hyenas or troglodytes. Hey, listen. You're leaving, uh, Sierzo, right? Hang on. Here, it's not much, but it should help uh, up a little. I'll keep trying to make it up to you, Kit. I promise. This is awful. How in uh, a lot's name am I going to be able to live like this? And... He makes me want to slap him. Why would I want to save a society, though, that punishes every member of your bloodline for the you know, fuck up of one person. Never understood the uh, appeal of that concept. I have a feeling I know what the mineral in mineral tea is going to be.
Okay. So let's go make more termit pottage. Panic at the Disco reference from a neighbor? Wait, what? Hey Zephyr, bye Zephyr, numb. I mean, you could always name your internet something like you'll never guess how big my balls are. I mean, it is an option, don't you think?
Is there something you need? I mean, or you could do something like suck my ass and win a prize. <laughs> yes, I'm fairly aware that I'm going to hell for these jokes, by the way. I'm gonna go make a bunch of fire stones. Nice. Okay, let's go make some fire stones. We'll make six of them. Now I've got to ask, are you guys ready to get down with it? Sorry, my brain died. <laughs> Is there something you need?
Oh dear lady, come here, let me see if I can do things with your face. Amber, my friend. Amber, my friend. Can you teach me how to fight? When the enemy bears down on you, a swift dodge will get you out of harm's way. Blocking will prevent the enemy's physical strikes from harming you, but every hit you block will drain your stamina. If you need to get into a better position, or to flee, just sprint. Curious. By the way, this one does have a much brighter light. Somebody has the router name Tifi. I'm gonna go see if I can buy a circlet. I might get a good night's sleep tonight. Is there something you need? Oh, right. I should probably come over here for the circlet. The chick who actually sells hey, it. Cool. Now I have the proper attire of a mage. Well, damn. 
That's a good number of people you can't find, Aiden. Numb. Anyways, folks. I think this is where I'm going to leave off for tonight. So, if you enjoy the gameplay or the commentary, give us a like. If you want to keep up with this or any of our other content, hit subscribe and ring the bell. Become part of our notification squad so you can see when we upload and when we go live. But for now, this is Kit the Solus signing off. So until next time, everybody. Bye-bye. Nom. Also, and there will be a next time relatively, uh, well, in a couple hours from now. So numb. I'm numb. I'll see you guys then, though. Because ye. Also, is it just me, or does anybody else think that the Scarlet Nexus game, the storyline, is getting a little fucky?